So you're playing a game. It's all about a game. There's a, there's a great scene in 1984. This is Orwell's dystopia. And they're interviewing this guy, Winston, and they're trying to get him to admit that two plus two is five. This is the essence of political correctness in a nutshell. Winston, you got to admit that two plus two is five. And Winston goes, no, no, I've given up my wealth. I've given up my family. I've given up everything. For me, I have only one freedom left. And that's the freedom to say that two plus two is still four. And so what do they do? They put him in a dark room. They turn off the lights, sensory deprivation, all kinds of torture. And finally, poor Winston breaks down. And he goes, two plus two is five. And he goes, can I go now? And they go, no, Winston, we're not satisfied. He goes, why not? I, I, I told you what you wanted. I told you that two plus two is five. They go, we know that. But in your mind, you still think it's four. You're only saying it's five because you know that's what we want to hear. Our goal is to beat you into such conformity that you think inside your mind that two plus two is four. This is what the socialists want to do. In 1984, they want to make Winston into a worm. They want to destroy his ability to not only operate in a free economy, but to be a free man even in his own mind. And I'll, I want to suggest that that's actually what's going on in a, in, Tocqueville talked about soft despotism in America. We have it. That's what's going on here. An attempt to beat us down into intellectual submission. Now, if you happen to agree with the orthodoxy, you don't feel it. But if you don't agree, that's when you begin to feel it. That's when ultimately the guns are, you may say, trained against you. 